Hey there planners, it's my favorite thing, a huge stack of fun planner supplies. Today I'm talking about all of my favorite fall planning supplies. These are the things that I reach for and pull out every fall season. I've got some new items, I've got some oldies but goodies. I'm gonna be going through all of my favorite supplies for fall. So go grab your planners and let's get planning. I've got pens, I've got washies, I've got notebooks, I've got notebook covers, I've got coffee. You should get coffee too. I'm going to go through all of my favorite supplies for planning in the fall and how I decorate and bring my planner and journals into the fall season. I get so excited about fall. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's the pumpkin spice latte and I'm all jacked up on sugar. I don't know, but I get so excited about planning in the fall. It's the holiday season, meaning our planning tools are going to really work hard for us to make sure that we do all the things we need to do and enjoy our time in the upcoming holiday season. So this is a time of year I get super excited and I want my planner to reflect that excitement of the changing season. So I've got a lot of things here. I've got more things outside of the view of this camera. Um, I've got new things that I've just discovered that I'm really excited to share. And I've got some oldies but goodies that um, I'm definitely going to be pulling out again this season. So let me slide everything out of the way. We'll go one by one. As always, everything's going to be linked down in the description box below in case you want to check something out. So uh, let's get started. All right, I'm going to start with Hubman and Chub Girl and the Coffee Lo Lovers Collection. I have talked about this in detail, so I'm not going to go through everything that's in the box again. Look at my adorable little coffee mug that I am absolutely using on theme. I think that this company, Helpman and Chub Girl, they get it. They get fall. They get as excited as I do about fall. They have even more fall-themed collections on their website right now. And the boxes come with so many goodies. It's amazing. I just think they're so cute and um, really bring things into the fall season. I've brought my planner into the fall season using uh, the Hubman and Chub Girl Coffee Lovers collection. So highly recommend them and you can save 15% with the discount code that I have down in the description box. So definitely go check them out. Again, if you want to see a full unboxing of this Coffee Lovers collection, I'll have that link down below for you to go check out. All right, this is a new item that I discovered on Amazon. I was searching for some coffee themes, some fall theme stickers, and I came across this sticker book. This is from Mr. Paper. It's called The Gorgeous Fantasy Afternoon Coffee. And I was blown away by the quality of the stickers. So these are clear st vinyl stickers and Hopefully you can see, get the idea there, but these stickers are absolutely gorgeous. And the other thing I love about it is that there are, there's one sheet of clear vinyl and one sheet of matte paper. So this is the matte paper sheet and they're the same stickers across the two pages. So these are the clear vinyl. These are the matte uh, sticker paper. And these stickers to me are just perfect for journaling. Look at the sweet treats <laughs> with the cookies and the little vintage coffee shop. I mean, these are just really beautiful stickers. I'm loving little coffee, the vintage coffee uh, cart and the coffee maker, bean grinder. They're so beautiful. And I really think these are going to be awesome for journaling. These just look like fantastic journaling stickers to me. Um, and the fact that there are two pages of each where you can really tailor how you're using them. Look at this. Oh, so cute. The little bean grinder. It's adorable. Absolutely love them. Love the scenes and the scenery. And uh, there's like a good amount in here. Look at the fall foliage. I love fall themed flowers the coffee and the books like yes this is the fall aesthetic I'm going for love these I cannot wait to use these okay this page just makes me hungry because look how gorgeous look how gorgeous these cookies I mean it's like you can almost smell the cookies 
<laughs> this is making me hungry. This book is actually making me hungry. They're just really high quality. And then in the back, you actually have some boxes, some circles, like really basic planner stickers, which I think is really cool. Some labels um, with coffee themed items on there. I just, what a great sticker book and really reasonably priced. This was a great find. And I actually found a couple more. I'll have all of the ones that I came across like this um, with the same sort of dual pages um, and great fall themes. I'll have them all linked down below. Okay, Amazon is slowly but surely coming along in the PET tape department. And if you're not familiar with that, they are sort of clear, vinyl tapes with stickers that you sometimes have to fussy cut, sometimes they're pre-cut. I did a search for fall themed PET tapes on Amazon. For the past year, it's been really difficult to find much on US Amazon. They are definitely coming along. So I'm gonna go ahead and pull these out, swatch them, and then you can actually see the fall themes and what I have found. So for this first one, I'm not actually going to cut them, but I want you to see, I'll just slide this through. Look how gorgeous. This is a coffee themed PET tape, and I cannot believe that I found this on Amazon. Look how beautiful the little, oh, I love those coffee beans. I cannot wait to use this in my journal. And the theme just keeps going. Like I haven't, I decided not to cut it because I haven't actually found the repeat items yet. It just keeps going. I don't know when the pattern repeats. So, I mean, it just keeps going. So I, I am absolutely thrilled by this. Now, the way this works, I will, um, let me roll it up and I'll show you just cut by cutting one out. All right, so I cut off the end here and I've got this one little one I'm gonna keep cutting and I'm just gonna cut it out like this, okay? Now, there is, this is the tricky part, especially if you have fingernails. There's a backing on here that you have to pull off and sometimes it takes a little patience, but you can see like I'm pulling the clear backing off. And then I have this clear vinyl sticker that I can use in my journal or planner. And so that's the effect. And so I put it on the page and then kind of journal around it. And you can see there's, there's like smaller ones. So maybe I fussy cut this one out and just have this piece, you know, there's quotes and things. So this, this set is pretty amazing. And like, look how much, and I couldn't find the pattern repeat. I'm sure it repeats somewhere, but I couldn't find it. But the artwork is pretty incredible. I'll pull this up close so you can see it. Like, look at that. Wouldn't that just be gorgeous on a fall journaling page or a planner page? Really, really nice. So this one is definitely a winner. It's all coffee themed. And uh, for early fall, uh, that's I'm really going for like a coffee theme. Okay, for this next one, this is kind of like a coffee shop menu themed and it's got all these goodies on it. And you can see like it's got little quotes, small cup of coffee, a cup of coffee and a small cake, waffles, dessert, hot cocoa. It's got some arrows and numbers on it. And you can see like the pattern has it. Okay, that, that's where the pattern starts. So all of this <laughs> is how much you get before the pattern restarts. And this has a little bit of a frosted color on it, so they're not completely clear. It's got a little bit of frosting on it, but I just think for journaling pages, this is so adorable, really well priced. So this is another um, one that came in a set of six, and I'm gonna show you each one of those. Okay, this one is more kind of fall girl themed, but it also has some coffee and it's got some quotes, coffee and cream, their coexistence can always make taste buds excited. So that's an interesting little quote. I think I like the girls. I'm not sure about the little like lazy afternoon, half cup of milk, half cup of concentrated, just right. Mm, I don't even know what that means, but the coffee is beautiful. <laughs> so I don't know about the words. Uh, or the little sayings, but the girls are so cute. 
and I love the, the, you know, like happiness, comfortable. I love those little arrows and coffee. So there's another, you know, big set of washi, of PET tape um, that you can sort of fussy cut and put in your journal as accents. Okay, this one has some really cute, like, downtown or coffee shop storefront scenery which I think is really cute early autumn a nice day it's got some really cute storefront look at that cute little cafe I don't know that these are necessarily autumn themed and the pattern repeats pretty quickly so I don't know how I'll use these but I do think they're really cute and they're going to be easy to cut out just like one scene cut that out Okay, here's another one, very coffee themed, but we also have some sort of daily life plants. Oh, I love that. Look at the little coffee stains. Won't that be so cute? The glasses and the cup of coffee. The percent sign is really cute. Some camera, like really cute journaling elements. I think these will be nice to be able to cut out. Okay, now this is very unique. This is like labels and boxes, text boxes, but it also has some coffee stains on them. So that is really cute. I really like these. Now, I don't know, you'd probably have to use a special, you know, kind of oil-based pen to write on these because they are vinyl. So I'm not sure how functional they're gonna be, but I do think I love the coffee stains on the lake. That's really cute. And they're gonna make very cute journaling elements. Okay, last but probably my favorite is uh, some fall themed florals, which I think are really adorable. Look how beautiful these flowers are. And there are some really light quotes. I don't even know that you could see that quote on white paper, but yeah, these are super cute. Um, fall themed florals. All right, so that is the set of six that came together, sort of coffee themed, some fall themed, some that could be other seasons, and then the really beautiful artwork PET tape of coffee themed. I'm just excited to see Amazon starting to stock these because as I have been on the hunt for, for a U.S. based PET tape distributor or seller, I've had a hard time finding those. If you know of anywhere that sells really good quality PET tapes and, you know, journaling tapes, journaling stickers, things like that in the U.S., let me know. But the Washi Tape Shop is another good place to get this type of stuff from. But yeah, so I'm on the hunt. I'm glad to see Amazon starting to trend this way. I hope the collection continues. All right, let's talk planner covers. I have three different sizes by three different brands. These are sort of my go-to fall planner color scheme and things that I reach for. So this is an A6 Ox Knight cover. Ox Knight is a brand that is fairly new to probably newest on the block to Amazon. And I got to tell you, I absolutely, this is holding an A6 Stology. And um, if you're interested in learning more about what this is, I'll have some links down below. But um, I absolutely love this color. This color is that burnt orange, just quintessential pumpkin spice latte. <laughs> give me more of fall color. I am absolutely loving it. Um, I don't have a lot of decoration in here, but you can see sort of the pocket system. And then in the back pocket back here, you know, you've got slip pocket, notebook pocket, and then the secretarial pocket. So yeah, this is gorgeous. I love this. This is a week's size uh, planner cover from Smart Fee. I actually use this as a wallet for a little while. Um, I've got this little homemade coffee in there, but like the pockets are pretty amazing and perfect for a wallet. You've got a pocket there, you've got a pocket there, a pocket there, place to put the notebook there, a zipper, another pocket here. This, I it actually came with the bookmark attached. I cut that out. And then you've got the big back pocket. So this was really nice for using for a wallet. And it's also just gorgeous. This is from a brand called Smart Fee. 
uh, which is another uh, like great knockoff Moterm option. Both of these rival Moterm quality, um, but not at Moterm prices. So these are really great options. And then of course I do have Moterm. So this is a Moterm A5 planner cover. It's got the bookmarks in it. You've got a ton of pockets, slip pocket here, slip pocket here, place to put the notebook, two pockets here, secretarial, big back pocket, you know, pin loop. So these three are definitely the brands that I shop the most for in planner covers. I do have some other brands, but these definitely are kind of my go-to planner covers. And this color scheme um, is great for fall. So these are options if you're, you know, one of the quickest ways to bring your planner into the fall season is to switch out the cover that it's in. And these are all really great options for doing that. All right, for pens and markers, these are the sets that I reach for the most. None of these are new to me, but these are the like steadfast. I pull these out every fall season. I actually pack them away so that I'm not tempted to use them year round. I don't want to use them up. I want to make them last as long as possible. So the first set is from Zebra Sarasa. These are the Zebra Sarasa clip in vintage colors. They're so gorgeous. They're so beautiful. They're gel pens. They write great. Um, the pit ink does go quick. So I have some that are running low. I'm probably going to have to replace, replace the set after this year, or maybe even halfway through the year, but look at the jewel tone colors. They are just gorgeous. I love these for fall. Rivaling this set is a set from Rytec. So these are Rytec 0.5. They're dual color. So each pin has two colors. So you actually get more colors than you have in this set. Um, so for example, and the pin body is telling you what colors are in there. So you've got some great olives. This gold tone really rivals this gold tone, uh, this camel tone zebra sarasa. Um, you've got the olive and yellow. You've got the deep purple and gray, the burgundy and navy, a just really, really great set. And then the other set that I reach for quite a bit are the Crayola Colors of the World. And this is just a sample, like this whole bag is full of all my Crayola markers. I absolutely love them for fall. They're such great neutrals. And you've got a couple of different sizes. You can do the skinny ones that actually act like pens or the wider ones if you wanna do some highlighting or some actual coloring. Those are great too. These are really great for Bible journaling too, I have found. so. These are my go-tos. They're not new, but they are definitely being pulled out for the fall season and probably my absolute favorite fall pin collections, marker collections. These are it. All right. And the last thing I want to talk about is this adorable little pin bag. I am so in love with this pin bag. Look at these little foxes. Isn't that so fun? This is such a fun little bag. Okay, so I have been looking, um, and don't you love the tag? Like how descriptive is this tag? Utility pouch for carrying tools. And that's exactly what I do with it. It is a little utility pouch for carrying all my tools. I needed something small that I could put things in that I would carry around with my A6 little daily, you know, commonplace notebook. And I wanted it to hold just my favorite pens and highlighters. So, look how much stuff I have in here. I, pr I probably have it packed too full. So I've got like pens and highlighters galore in here. Look, look at how many pens and highlighters I have in here. It's deceptively small because it actually holds a ton. Let me back out. Okay, so that is the monstrosity amount of pens and highlighters that I'm holding in here. Um, I, these little big gelosities, oh, I'm loving these right now. Okay, I also have some stickers, some tabs, some little car, credit card size stickers in here. Um, I have some, my tweezers, my favorite little planner tweezers in here, some whiteout. What are these? More sticky notes. Okay, so that is all the space in the center. Like, that's a ton of space. I had all of this in there, plus all of these little side pockets that I have stuffed to the guild full of stuff. Okay, and then all around the outside, I'm not even using all of these yet. You've got a row of pockets there, another row, like two rows of pockets on the outside here. You've got um, pinhole 
uh, little loops here to put like a strap if you wanted to put a strap on it and make it a little purse. How cute would that be? And then more here. I've got a pair of scissors here and then two other pockets. Oh, that's cute. Um, two other pockets here. I've got some sticky notes. So anyway, this is just such a great size. If I know I'm going to be doing some journaling or need to take some notes for something, I just grab this little bag and I, I'm in love with it. Now this is not the only pattern. There are a bunch of patterns for this. I was specifically looking for something fall themed and I just kind of wanted to test it out. Um, and I love it. I absolutely love this. I'm probably going to get it in a couple more patterns for other times of year, but it is the perfect little grab and go, uh, utility pouch for carrying all your tools. Accurate accurate tagging. All right, so I hope you enjoyed seeing some of my favorite fall supplies. I would love to hear how are you bringing your planner into the fall season? Leave that down below. Are there some supplies that I'm missing that I should be checking out? You know, I'm always looking for a reason to get some new planner supplies and celebrate the fall season. So if you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up, subscribe to Planet Annie for more content like this. And as always, thanks for planning with me.